if enough good people start actually caring about things that are important and not what their face looks like on, on, on Snapchat or anything else of that stupidity, but actually start caring about one another, we can turn this stuff around. So this is some technology here. Mama, Mama Belle actually had this technology used on her. All right. And this is called, uh, she had the shockwave, the tripsy or whatever. Yeah, there you go. And treatment of ur urinary system stones. So they took my mom, she had kidney stones, and they put sound waves next to her stomach, and they destroyed all those kidney stones. Waves. You understand this? Frequency. Frequency. Okay? Now here's the next point. Dr. Royal. Raymond Wright cured cancer over 90 years ago with that technology. So let me tell you something, folks. If you've had somebody die of cancer, it's time to get mad. It's time to get angry. If somebody was taken from me, it should still be here. Okay? Dr. Royal Raymond Wright cured cancer in 1934. What was his, uh, what did he get for uh, curing cancer? He got killed. And his uh, technology stole. There he is. He was sent 17 terminally ill cancer patients. Terminally. Stage like pawpaw. Last got a week to live, two weeks, every single one of them lived. One hundred percent success rate. Why? Because the technology that he had, the set sound wave, went and destroyed the cancer cells and left the what? The living cells alone. It was tuned to the frequency of the cancer. So what do we do with chemo? And people still don't get it. 70 years of cancer research and we're still doing chemo. Are you really telling me telling me we're still doing chemo? Come on, folks. Snap out of it. Snap out of it. Everybody go, oh, can you donate to Breast Cancer Awareness Month? Folks, it's a big old mind screw. Not at all. It, it kills the living cells and the, the cancer cells. Oh. It kills you. It's microwave technology. It's you might as well just step in a microwave. Mm -hmm. This is a microbiotelescope. The first. In 1932, he managed to isolate a cancer microorganism known as 15 virus. A year after he designed the universal microscope that can magnify an object 60,000 times their normal size. He postulated, now we just read this, he postulated life forms oscillate at certain frequencies, destroying organisms using a natural frequency without destroying adjacent tissue. So everything he did, he tuned to the frequency of the cancer, destroyed it, zapped it, boom. The same way the kidney stone was, resonates at a different frequency than your ki kidney tissue. That's how they go through there with that sound and destroy it. So today, listen to me, folks. Today, we are using Royal Raymond Price technology, but to do kidney stones. And not kill cancer. And not kill cancer. Folks, that's pretty screwed up. Nobody realizes it. Well, if you don't know what frequency is, this is the point of the study. How important this is. This is the biological life. So let's get, let, let me stop right there and get back to the study. All right, folks.